So this just came in the mail. Um, it is from Peak Design. It's called the Clutch Camera Hand Strap. And I haven't installed it yet, but just on opening this up a few minutes ago, I'm pretty sure this is going to be like the best thing I've ever bought for my camera. And I'll show you why I'm so excited about this. So I got this Olympus OMD EM5 Mark II and uh, if I have this lens on it, it's actually really awkward in your hands because it's kind of front heavy um, and it's a bit clumsy. And the camera strap I find on this, and I've used the Nikon DSLR for years uh, with with a big strap like this, and I find on that it's, it's fine. The camera's big enough and it has this big chunky grip on the front. So I don't have to use the strap, I can just grab it here. You'll notice this Olympus doesn't really have much of a grip there. So there's not much for me to dig my fingers into to hold on to it. Um, and I find the strap at times when I go to pick it up just gets in the way of all that. And since I've installed it, I've been kind of horrified. I'm gonna accidentally snag this on something or grab the wrong part of it and let this new camera that cost a couple of bucks, you know, whack into something and get damaged. And so I did a Google search to see if there was something smaller as a strap and that pointed me at this. Um, and I'm gonna put it on now and see how that goes. Give you uh, this thing here. I've got this plate that's gotta come off. And the first thing that makes this really worth my 50 bucks, right out of the box, aside from everything else, is actually that it seems as if this plate they give you to use it replaces this one. So this is one of those quick release, I believe, Arca Swiss style adapter plates for the bottom of the camera, meaning that I can have the hand strap and the ability to just snap this into my tripod. And interestingly, I've been having an awful time trying to find a small enough one of these to fit the compact tripod I have. It seems like these come in two different sizes. This looks like the smaller one. I haven't gone to try it on my new tripod yet, but I'm super, super stoked. Um, especially if this actually fits on there. Brilliant. It goes in here and they want you to use the little Ikea key here to tighten that down firmly. Doesn't seem like it's blocking any of my controls or anything. Nice and snug but not stupid. And then apparently all you do is uh, remove your existing strap. I don't like this strap. It's too stiff, and so I want this thing off of here. And of all the things I'm not very good at, installing camera straps is definitely pretty high on the list. Come on, you bastard. Okay, so that's off. I did not know in the product description I saw that it came with this, and I'm super, super stoked because I think that's going to fit on my new compact tripod. And I was going to actually, you know, go online and search for a different one of these. I think that's going to do it. So now the camera's free and clear. I believe what you do is you fish this through this. And look at that, it just goes through no problem, as if they know what they're doing, which I hear they do. It's the first thing I've ever bought from Peak Design, but I'm pretty sure it won't be the last. Um, and then you fit this uh, to the amount of tightness that you want. Uh, that, but look at that. This is so much better because now I feel the grip on it. I can snug that down to the size of my, of my hands here. At first glance, I may rotate this. I feel like it's actually going to be better if I turn it a bit that way. Look at this. I've got a good grip on there. I love that you've tightened this down and this is biting in nicely to my knuckles here so um, I'm able to hold the camera here but I also feel like a good amount of tension that's sort of confirming for me that I've got a good grip on this thing um, with that part of the strap I'll probably you know play around with this and see um, exactly you know maybe there's a better setup for it moving some things around but I am just super pumped with how that feels in my hand I don't have this big thing hanging around underneath it this tensioning strap doesn't seem like it has anywhere to go to get it out of the way, but man, that feels so much better than having this big, this big thing in the way.
and to take it off, you just slide your hand out and done. And if you want to put this on a different camera, which I'm probably going to get one for my other camera, you press into this little thing here. This is like their proprietary connection system. Press down, slide it up. And just to show you how that works to put it back on, you just kind of allow it down into there and it gives you that click. You know that's in there. And they say that these little cables can hold like 90 pounds or something. Slide your hand in. And if you don't want that on there anymore, then you would just press this. And I guess you would just uh, push this little guy. Come on. A little tight there. Slide that out. Boom. Let's put that back on again just to see how quick it is. So now I've got my tripod plate, which I will confirm after that fits on my tripod. The only sacrifice is I've just got this little dongly thing hanging out here, but I can take that off if I don't want it. Then when I want this back on, slide through here. It's just going to go in like that. So that's on there nice and secure. Bottom of this is going to slide into that. Oh man, just look at the, the feel of that. It's right there. You squeeze it the way you're supposed to hold this camera up like this, and you can feel that biting nicely into your knuckles. You know that's on there securely. Adjust the tension by just pulling down on this like that. That's a great grip on there. This is really the way to do it. This is really a lot better. Uh, maybe some further adjustments required. Anyway, yeah, I think if this fits on my tripod, which I'll show you in a second, that this is probably um, the single best thing I've ever bought for my camera. So a little update, that clutch wrist strap actually does fit perfectly into my tripod, but you'll see that here I'm using it on my larger Nikon camera and not the Olympus. And the reason why is that after a couple of days I found that the clutch hand strap is actually a little bit too small, a little bit too tight around my hands in order to be able to use my fingers on the top controls of that Olympus camera. So I ended up installing it onto the Nikon uh, D5300 that I'm using instead. And actually it just feels even that much better on there. And I'm able uh, to make better use of uh, my pointer finger in order to use the shutter. What I ended up doing on the Olympus was installing this instead to help give me a better grip on it. And this is the Peak Design cuff. And what you do using that same proprietary connector is either remove it and then you've got this just handheld. Again, you can see here not much of a grip. And when you want some extra grip on there, slide this little guy in there until it clicks. And then you've got this hand strap like that and it snugs up against your wrist. You can hold it here. And this is an even better solution because it completely frees your hands uh, and your fingers to use these upper controls that are important on this camera. Uh, with a little bit more dexterity uh, and also gives me the protection I want that I'm not going to drop it. And so to sum up, Nikon D5300 best with this clutch camera hand strap like that because I can still use the shutter button which I couldn't use with my pointer finger as easily on the Olympus. So this guy is great for this camera and on the smaller mirrorless Olympus OMD, the Peak Design wrist cuff to me these are the two perfect accessories for these two different sizes of cameras